The following video is a recap of Shink's Community Day. Welcome to Lewis's Adventures Plays Pokemon Go with me, Lewis Marinucci, as your host. If you like this video, please hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for alerts of when I upload new content to the channel, especially those with disabilities similar to mine. In this video, I will be covering Shink's Community Day, and hopefully, I'll be getting a lot of shinies. Which, of course, unlike Duskull Community Day, which I'd forgotten about and couldn't make a video about, this time I will make a video covering this, this special event. And, of course, I will also be completing the special research story for Shink's Community Day as well. First off, this community day got off to a frustrating start as it took me a while to get my first shiny and I will explain later on why in this segment, but the special research story for Shink's community day was called Flash, Spark, and Gleam and of course I'm about to go over the steps for step one, which of course you had to power up a Pokemon 10 times with the reward of 15 Pokeballs, catch 15 Shinx with the reward of a Shinx encounter, and lastly, make five nice throws with the reward of 20 Shinx candies, and your total rewards are. 20,000 Stardust, Shinx Encounter, and 1 Incense. For Step 2, you had to catch 15 Shinx with the reward of 30 Shinx Candies. Transfer 10 Pokemon with the reward of a Luxio Encounter. And evolve 3 Shinx with the reward of 3 Pineapple Berries. And your total rewards were 1,500 XP, a Shinx encounter, and one incense. For step three, you had to make three great curveball throws with the reward of 50 Shinx candies. Evolve one Luxio with the reward of one star piece and transfer 10 Pokemon with the reward of 15 Great Balls. Your total rewards were 2,500 XP, 1 Rocket Radar, and 15 Great Balls. And the following rewards, 2 Silver Pineapple Berries, a Shinx Encounter, and 3,500 XP are automatically obtained without doing anything. And your total rewards were 3,000 Stardust, a Lux Ray Encounter, and two rare candies. And of course, back to the shinies. As you see here, it took me a while, almost 40 
minutes to an hour to get my first shiny Shinx, which of course, as you see here, it's a female. And of course, I got sidetracked by being invited to a Cresselia raid, as you see here. Of course, it didn't become a shiny, and I miserably failed to get it. But in the end, I still had fun, I was successful, and at the end of this video, I have an announcement to make for everyone, so stay tuned for this announcement. Well, today, my final shiny count is 16. Yes, 16 shiny Shinx. I was not able to get two more females that I need for my shield version, but hopefully I can do that in the future, including when Community Day weekend in December comes up. And of course, I also have an announcement to make as well. I finally made it to Twitch Affiliate, and of course, during my live stream on Twitch, I also was able to get the additional shinies. And of course, the last one I got after I ended my stream. In the meantime, this is Lewis saying, thanks for watching, everyone. You can also follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, Twitch, and TikTok. And remember, it's time for adventure. Also, during these times when heading out, wear masks in public indoor settings, Practice social distancing, carry hand sanitizer with you, wash your hands, most importantly get vaccinated, and of course, stay safe, stay healthy and together, we are finally getting through these dark times together, but we're not out of the woods just yet.